Hi, welcome to All About WordPress. In this video, I'm going to show you how to configure WooCommerce Waitlist plugin. This plugin helps you to notify a customer when product is back in stock. So let me show you how to configure it. So this is the WordPress page of Waitlist plugin. You can either download the plugin from here and upload it in the WordPress dashboard by going to plugins and add new section. You can upload the zip over here by clicking on the upload plugin or you can search here. Here it is. I'm going to install it. And then activate. And you can see a waitlist tab in the WordPress dashboard after activating plugin. Click on it and go to the settings page. You can see waitlist settings page. So you can enable the guest waitlist like. If you want your guest user to add their email or like they were, you want to notify them, then you can enable it over here. And if you want to send email automatically when the product is back in stock, you can just enable this one. And you want to make user enter how much quantity they require, then you can take this. And if you want to show the waitlist button in the product list page, then you can enable this too. And this is for the customization of the waitlist button label. You can name it whatever you want. So I'm just going to be making it as default as join waitlist itself. And this is like adding animation to your waitlist. I'm just going to put this as default settings. And you can see email over here. Here you can enter the sender email address as well as the name. Okay. And then if you want to show any logo in the email, then you can give it over here. And then this is all for email customization. And just click on the save changes button after that. And here it is the advanced tab. This is a pro version of this plugin. You can purchase the pro version to get all other features over here. You can just go through this page to know what are the features available to so, so I'm going to show you how it occurs in my shop page. I'm just going to. So, my site is reloaded. You can see in my shop page there is a join waitlist button. I can either click from here or I can go to the product detail page and from there I can add the join waitlist also. So both say you can see a button. If you want to disable shop list, you can do it just the way I told in the settings page. So I'm just gonna click join waitlist. So I can give an email address over here. An email address. I want it to and just then click on email me when available so i'm getting you now available wait list so yes just close it when this product is back in stock i'm gonna get a notification for whoever the customer is gonna get a notification saying that the product is back in stock and they can purchase so it's pretty much easy to configure also and it can boost your sales too that's all guys. Thank you.